Hey, Lakers Nation, the season is on fire. Let's take a look at this whole scenario to understand what could happen from here. We've been on this NBA journey for two months, and the Lakers are making their mark with a 15-11 record, occupying 8th place in the Western Conference. It's not the time to freak out, but there's that little worry, right? Expectations were high and we know we can go further. Our weaknesses are there on the table, long distance shooting, defense on the perimeter and perhaps some holes on the wing and power forward. Oh, and there's one more thing, we need a third scoring option to give LeBron James a breather and keep the fire burning when he rests. And then comes the talk of trades, especially with a look at Zach Levine, from the Chicago Bulls. But, wait, there are a lot of people divided as to whether this would be the Lakers' best move. People have suggested a different trade, one that involves the Bulls, but not Levine. It's an interesting proposal, Rui Hakimura, Jalen Huchifino and a 2029 first-round pick going to the Bulls, while the Lakers would receive Alex Caruso and Patrick Williams. Caruso, my friend, is like a hero around here, right? Top-notch defender, and look, he's improved a lot in shooting threes this season. Almost 50% success rate, no small feat. Williams, fourth pick in the 2020 draft, could be a great addition to our team. Despite some negative points, the guy maintains that he is a beauty, hits some shots from distance and still has a lot of room to grow. Of course, with this change, we would lose Hakimura, a key scorer from the bench, the guy has a good average per game. And then the doubt arises as to whether Williams would be the guy who would create his own shots to provide relief for LeBron and the AD. The trade would also involve giving up a future first-round pick. The crowd is divided, as we've already given up one in the past, and it's important to keep the trick up our sleeve for after LeBron's reign. Anyway, my friends, there is a lot of speculation going around. Would this exchange be good or not? We will need to hold on to this anxiety and see what the next steps will bring. Stay tuned because the Lakers world is buzzing and something new could happen at any moment. So, that's it for today, folks. Stay with us and let's root for the Lakers together. To the next.